Stephen here from Recreational Power Sports coming at you with another trading mode here. So this is a 2014 Beeliner 185BR. This one's in very good overall condition. I'm going to go through the whole unit top to bottom with you guys. So first off, as you can tell, caravan trailer, uh, swing weight tongue, brakes, jack, winch, everything. Very good overall condition, galvanized, so it's not going to rust very easily. Uh, so that's a good pro. As we come alongside the boat, this one's in really, really good condition. The black doesn't have much damage. The white is in very good condition. So nothing really to write home about at the outside of the boat. Uh, nice chrome cleats and uh, bumper on this one. Let's come alongside. You can see we got a spare tire here. Very nice feature. You know, if anything ever happens, it gets you off the highway. The decals are in very good condition. Barely even anything to write home about for 2014 on this one. As you keep coming along the back, you can see we got the bimini right there. So it's a factory bimini on it. Nice feature to keep you out of the sun while you're cruising on those hot days. And as you come to the back of the boat, you can see here we got the swim platform and then we got the extended swim platform with the rear boarding ladder. The nice thing about the extended swim platform is that if you're getting ready to go to the lake or jump in the lake, I should say, with your skis on or anything, the drive is hidden underneath the extended platform. So it's pretty safe, really hard to hit the drive, hit the prop, so it is nice and safe. Very nice feature there. Uh, rear boarding ladder, nice feature to get out of the water. As you can tell, we got the Alpha 1 Generation 2 leg, nice four blade prop with the hydrofoils, help you get up on plane a little faster. We have right there the ski pylon, so that's a very nice feature to be able to yank tubes, water skis, uh, any board sports obviously. As you come alongside, you can see we got our decal here and the opposite side of the boat is in very good overall condition. Nothing to write home boat here with any issues. So follow me inside the boat. Let's go through the inside real quick. In the open bow here, you can see large and roomy. The only thing to really write home boat in this whole boat are these little rips here on the seat so three little ones it's the only flaw in the whole boat that I could see so just want everybody to be aware of that before they come down cool feature on this boat got storage underneath the helms on both sides and then obviously just your storage underneath the seat all the way around so lots of room lots of storage in this boat really nice features there as you walk through the center you can see no um, carpet on this boat very nice idea there so this way you could just pressure wash it out to clean it out uh, don't have to really worry too much about uh, wrecking the carpet getting sand stuck anywhere uh, at the dash you can tell here we got the big gauges with all the options in them two multi gauges and then a single trim gauge got a hummingbird uh, four inch screen right here so it's a fish finder if you're not a fisherman use it for depth super cool Driver's helm, we got the bolster seat. We all know what that does. It gets you up and above the steering wheel while you're cruising and uh, pulling tubes. So when your bow's up in there, you can see over your windshield without anything impeding you. When this is up, you also got my favorite tilt steering. Um, just allows you to get in and out of the boat a lot easier. On the opposite side here, you can see we got the back-to-back -back loungers. So it just gives you a little bit more seating passenger side we have the glove box as well as the stereo head usb and 12 volt there fire extinguisher the back of the boat here we have the two jump seats the two jump seats remove and you could place them like that to make a big sun tanning bed right so just a couple other nice features that bayline have thought of here storage underneath and as we get into the heart and soul of the boat here, we got the powerful Merc Cruiser 4.3 liter right there. So it's carbureted, can't get the hours off of it, but it is carbureted and uh, it's fully serviced and ready to hit the water. The only last thing that I forgot to mention was we got a large ski locker right here in the middle of the boat. There's a little bit of water in it, but it is large. You can, uh, have all your skis, whatever you want in there, a little bit of water in there. When we lift it up, it will drain. So 
If you have any other uh, questions or concerns, you can check us out at recreationalpowersports.com. The one thing I forgot to mention, this does have a bow and cockpit cover with it. So it is fully ready, serviced, ready to go to the lake. So when you want to come down, check it out or come on down and pick it up. We'll be happy to help you out.